ham tool always used to stiffen surface add safety or include appearance in a sheet metal parts so here we will learn what type of ham tools in autodesk inventor so just go to sheet metal tab create panel and you will activate ham tool now this is already a 20 by 30 mm plate and the thickness of this plate is 0.7 mm if you comes first shape unfold this is a k factor you have to define we will discuss later in any tutorial and bend we already create a full complete lecture on bend so just focus on shape the first type of ham is single okay now second is shape you have to check select any edge either bottom or top from this button you can flip the direction if you see the front view see now here the gap the gap between these two thickness it's right now 0.7 into 0.5 is 0.35 even though directly you can apply a dimension let's say 1 mm see the the next thing is length length from outer edge to inner edge let's say this one directly you can apply 3 mm or thickness into the ratio you can keep let's say 5 mm okay now if we say apply it is going to be apply look edit feature now just expand the window of ham and here you will find width extend now here we can define types of width first is edge the second one is width if we choose width you will see two options centered and option if we keep centered here simply apply let's say 20 and see it is going to expand okay look edit feature now if you choose offset in offset you have to choose one vertex point just click on the arrow and select this any any vertex i selected this one and apply dimension let's say 3 mm c it moves look it moves here right click edit feature and the next option is offset if we choose offset you have to define two vertex point one is already selected and this is 3 mm now second just select this end and define let's say 10 mm say okay look 10 mm from here 3 mm from here click ham and you will see the option edit sketch edit ham then last option is from two so for this i'll tell you add one more thing add flange i'll choose this edge let's say 15 angle let's say 160 okay 135 15 rest keep as it is okay now i'll show you how ham works here now first one edit feature suppress this one now again apply a new ham i am going to choose the same edge gap length everything applied expand the window and just come to from to okay now from and to first and end part you have to define there is two type of arrow so i'll start from here and end button i'll choose let's say this now look right see this is the start from this end and going to end up to this vertex so this is the feature from to if i say apply cancel look 
सप्रेस फीचर अनसप्रेस सप्रेस फ्लैंज नाउ लेट्स एडिट द फर्स्ट वन नाउ दिस इज द सिंगल नाउ लेट्स से डबल टीयर ड्रॉप In tear drop, you have to define radius. Now it is point seven. Let's say one millimeter angle. Let's say ninety. Okay, ninety is not going to be feasible. Forty. Okay, one. You have to apply more than two hundred because of thickness. Now see two hundred. If I put two seventy. now is going to near cross near full circle 300 c 270 and here we will apply simply width say okay look again right click edit feature and uh, the next one is rolled in rolled radius and angle okay now front now here this is also a inside radius let's say 1 mm let's say 2 mm and angle here you can define let's say 300 degree this is also near same to tear drop but tear drop is not circular face it is little expanded if i say yes look now the last one is double now here let's say gap the gap between these two thickness 1.5 now the length of this let's say 5 or let's say gap let's say 1 10 even though you can apply age or some, all the features you can simply apply here 20 say okay look this is double hand i hope you like it don't forget to share like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solid works and autodesk inventor thanks for watching flat pattern go ahead